my god. Okay, here's one. Because I was gonna say, you know, all... All I really do is I just, like, go to work. And then I come home from work and I, like, stream, and then I, afterwards, like, watch esports or do something. Do something else derpy. Well, we gotta, like... Um... Okay, so... Here's a great work story. So... Uh... Once upon a time, there was a lovely fellow by the name of Manok. And, you know, in, in our workflow, um, uh, Munosh was handling a lot of the playtest stuff. Like, making sure that we had a build ready for the playtest, make sure anything that needed to be cherry-picked with the branch was ready to go. Um, uh, chatting a lot with playtesters, um, getting any so feedback from just, you know, all, all the liaisoning, organizing sort of stuff. So he would always be, oh, as a result of this, very focused on the needs of the playtesters. Take him out, it's fine, it's cool. Do it, I don't care, I don't give a damn. Who do you want to hit? Want to hit that one? It's fine by me. Really wish I had a little bit more mana. Nope, no I don't. Nope, not a chance, not at all. I specifically do not wish I had extra mana. So, um... So, I think, it, I think it was Mark who did this. Mark did this little prank where, just for Minosh, just for Minosh, the size of units on the screen would shrink by, I think, so like 4% every three days. They just get a little smaller, a little smaller. So, Minosh's units, only Minosh's units, and only four Minosh on his machine. Would his units be a, li a little bit tinier? <laughs> and <laughs> Mark also put in this like little extra failsafe, where uh, you know how in StarCraft, you know like the mouse wheel where you can like scroll it and it like zooms in to look. If you if you did that, if you like, we, we had the scroll in so you could like zoom in. It's kind of like that. And if you did it, his units would pop back to normal size. And would stay there for about two or three minutes, and then just slowly shrink back down again. And the result, the result was that, <laughs> um, Minosha go, Sean, can, can you come here? And I'm like, yeah, what is it? And say, do, do my units look a little smaller? And I'd go, let me see. And I would walk his units next to enemy units, and then I'd, like, scroll in, and they'd be the same size. You're like, no, I mean, if you look at the models right next to they're the same size. He's like, okay, okay, cool. All right, cool. <laughs> and what what we what we thought would happen is that uh, eventually, Minosh would notice that something was going a little wrong. And that eventually, he would realize that there is a script called ManoshPrank.coffee that handles all the code for this. <laughs> and that he would, and that it would make sense. Because, you know, after like three weeks, I mean, the units are at like, you know, 40% size. They're like quite small. But sooner or later, like after two weeks, Minosh is like, guys, this, this unit shrinking thing is, is really significant like I don't it's the units are actually quite small on the screen and if this is happening My to other greetings. play testers greetings friend then this is gonna be a problem and you know we're like well you know if you can diagnose it great if you can like get get a repro for it but you know until it's affecting other play to play tests, it should be pretty low priority <laughs> you say all this crap and then uh Ian Ian ordered the exact same razor mouse pad he had, but in the in the medium and in the small size, and then just slowly started to replace things on Minosha's desk with slightly smaller things. <laughs> like Minosha had a big mug, and Ian got the exact same mug but a little bit smaller. <laughs> Until like. 
until <laughs> until even like he even uh bought <laughs> like bought like a really tiny mouse like a tiny mouse like you got three fingers and could like hold it <laughs> this tiny tiny mouse but, like it wasn't even subtle anymore it's just like everything is small and it, and at this point Minoche like knows something's going wrong with the code and Minoche has figured out that like scrolling in and scrolling out causes him to go back to normal size so when he's playing his units are like ants they're so tiny and he's just scrolling in and scrolling out constantly to get him to go back to normal size so he can keep playing <laughs> Oh, uh, so finally, um, we did a cherry pick that, uh, made a change only to Minoshprank.coffee, and then he's like, oh, you bastards. <laughs> oh, man, dude, Minosh is so awesome, Minosh thought it was so funny, he's like, I knew something was wrong, you bastards told me it was low priority. Oh, God, it was so good. <laughs> Oh, man. You know, now that I realize there's a lot of awesome things that happen at work, like mm. something that I enjoy attempting is making baskets with trash. Like, I have a trash can right here, and I never set anything in it. I was like, boom, I'll try to throw it in. So I have, um... I have a... a little crumpled piece of aluminum foil. Mike goes by the trash can. I said, Micah, hey, watch this. So I have it, and it's like, and it's very far away. And I'm like, watch this. And then I throw the aluminum foil, and it goes right over the trash can and hits a full cup of water on Mark's desk and just knocks water all over his mouse keyboard and mouse pad. And I'm like, oh my god, shit! <laughs> just like wander over there. Like, hey guys, watch this. And then I just make a mess. <laughs> Give me a... Oh, you can't see me! <laughs> 